our next guests are joining us for the first time, please welcome financial advocates from Penn Mutual, Wendy Lyon and Tari Watkins. Hello. Aww. Welcome to the show. Welcome to the show. What, no standing ovation? Uh, <laughs> that's for the crowd. <laughs> yeah, the crowd. <laughs> All those people. Um, so financial literacy. I've been doing financial advocacy on the radio for a long time now on TV, so I really appreciate what you guys are doing. It's so important. Um, people are learning by making mistakes these days. That's yeah. pretty much, yeah. you know, and sometimes that's a good way to learn a lesson, but it's a very hard way to learn a lesson. Sometimes it's too late when you learn that and way. And that's <laughs> the problem. You know, I yeah. feel lucky because I was young when I started making my financial mistakes. So I had a chance to get back. Right. You know, I had plenty of time. <laughs> a lot of people don't. So um, I have a lot of questions for you guys. I know you have a big event and there's a lot of purpose behind that. And I want to get to all that stuff. Um, first and foremost, there are a lot of, uh, I wish you would talk about gurus out there, right? They're on mm -hmm. big network television stations and they're on the radio, they're gurus. Mm. Um, what do you think about some of the, the gurus out there for people who are following those gurus and their advice? Is it always right? Is it a good thing to do? What do you think? Well, there's a major flaw in that advice in that it's very linear for one thing where they just say, take a death benefit, invest in a good mutual fund earning 10% forever and you've just replaced your husband's salary, I'm giving you the short version. Mm -hmm. But they don't include taxes, inflation, technology, or maybe your home isn't paid off. Or you thought your kids were going to go away to college and stay away and they're living back at home with you. So it doesn't work in real life. And that's the problem is it all sounds great on paper, but we don't live on paper. We live in reality and life happens. And like you've learned the hard way, that's one of my taglines is I learn the hard way so you don't have to. Yeah. So it's our job to help you avoid those pitfalls and go, this is what could really occur. So we do full disclosure financial decisions where we put reality into it and stress test it to make sure it's gonna stand up any under any circumstances, not yeah. just the best circumstances. I think what you're saying is uh, the, the summary of that is any time someone says do this specific thing, it's a generalization? Yes. In other words, everyone can just do this <laughs> and it'd be fine. That's kind of a red flag. Yeah. Right? Well, and if you could find me a mutual fund that's going to pay 10% forever, please fill me in. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Seriously. Well, it's going to average out. Yeah. It's not going to lose anyone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll never go down, ever. Well, since 1930, the market's <laughs> made this much money. <laughs> I know. I just exactly. saw an article the other day. In the past 16 years, the S&P is only, the compound average is less than 2%. Yeah. yeah. It's true. It's so. True. And people, and you can do the same calculation with real estate, too. Mm -hmm. Nationally, right? Not in San Diego is a little different, but nationally yeah. you can make the same case for real estate over a really long period of time, two percent, right. which doesn't, you know, combat inflation yeah. or inflationary rates. It doesn't yeah. pencil out, does it? In yeah, the end. it's kind of interesting, isn't it? Yeah. So, so. gurus, then, <laughs> as far as that's concerned. Uh, we were going to name names. I'm going <laughs> to stay away from it. You're going to stay away from some names. <laughs> I did enough name bashing <laughs> just, in the radio days. <laughs> I mean, you know, it was like no, I just talked like no one was listening back then. I mean, <laughs> we had about 80,000 viewers a week on the show. Right, right. So just don't drink the Kool-Aid. We'll yeah, just yeah, say yeah, that. Yeah, just, just don't, don't drink the Kool-Aid. Don't drink the Kool-Aid. Yeah. yeah. I think that's a good idea. And yeah. know that generalized advice is just that, in general, which means yeah. it could be good for you or could not be good for you, just exactly. as equally. Mm -hmm. Exactly. That's yeah. the thing. Yeah. It could equally be good or bad for you. So therefore, it's kind of pointless. <laughs> yeah, right? Well, <laughs> and if it is bad for you, what recourse do you have? None. Mm -hmm. Do you get to go find them and go, hey, I listened to your advice and... I'm living out of a shopping cart at 77 years old, so right. now what? I right. mean, yeah. what recourse do you have? And I think there's a, there's a whole lot to be said for this because although people are living a lot longer, and people are working longer, but we're living longer than we're working longer. So right. that ratio has started to cause some real problems. Well, what if Social Security isn't there anymore? What if won't that be there. doesn't hold up? I'll you tell you right now, it won't be there. Yeah, there's a cliff. And if people aren't planning today um, for that cliff, there's going to be lot of homeless people because <laughs> yeah. yeah. there's not there's no funds there to take care of them. If you took it away today, it would create a major, major problem. Oh, no, my word, definitely. Yeah. A major, major problem. My parents <coughs> are living on Social Security. Totally. A whole so, bunch of people are. Yeah. Yeah. Millions and millions yeah. of people are. <coughs> and that's okay because that's how, you know, their life was structured and what was expected right. and what they were promised yep. was this. They didn't have a lot of things that we have today. They were told they were just, everything was going to be okay. Mm -hmm. Now, take a look at, you know, people from the majority Millennials, Beck, for example, your generation. Not guaranteed. You don't have anything guaranteed. In fact, you know, 
cost of living is through the roof. <coughs> cost of education is through the roof. You guys are really catching the wrong end of the stick here. <laughs> yeah, to be honest I'm saving with you. my pennies now. Right? Seriously, <laughs> that dead serious. I mean, it's it's a really big deal. Yeah. So I think you know, not necessarily listening to the gurus. The gurus aren't preaching gospel here. You know, it's not necessarily true, right. um, and especially not necessarily true for you. But you guys have a, a great purpose behind what you're doing, not just providing financial advice or full, full disclosure financial advice like you were talking about. Um, you've got a big event coming up here soon, and I want to take the time to promote it because I think it's a really important cause. Who wants to talk about the event? When it's, it's actually really close to her heart, and I took on to co-host the event with her because how much she is very passionate about it, and I've become passionate about it too, so she's probably the better one if we can keep her from crying. Oh. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> You can cry. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, the event, it's really twofold um, because the New Year, New You movement was really created to empower women, although we won't turn men away, so you can come. Okay. <laughs> but um, so there's, it's twofold. So one part of it is to really achieve balance in your life. You know, a lot of people struggle with balance, so maybe your career is taking off and your career is thriving, but your personal relationships are suffering, or maybe your business is expanding, but... So is your waistline, and <laughs> maybe yeah. you know everything else is golden, but you need help planning your financial future. So this is a way to just come and get a holistic view from experts in all their fields to speak into your life in all these areas, personally, professionally, business-wise, mentally, emotionally, physically, mm -hmm. all in one day. But the best part is, is that all the proceeds will go to rescue children from human trafficking. So a, Which is a huge problem out there. Huge. Yeah. A child is trafficked every 30 seconds. Every 30 seconds. So in the time that we've done this segment, what is it, eight minutes? That's 16 children that have been trafficked for sex. When you look at it like that, and it happens day after day after day, it's mind boggling. But you know, I always say the only thing needed for evil to prevail is for good people to do nothing. So you may not be able to save a thousand lives, but can you save one? Yeah. You know, can you come and save one? So our goal is to save 50 lives at the event, and hopefully we'll save more. And we'll have more events and try to make an impact on it. But if we just sit back and go, well, it's too big to deal with, that, yeah. that does nothing. Or it's not happening here by the way it is. Right. And if it was your life that was <coughs> saved, how much would that matter to you? Yeah. You know, if it was your child. You would give anything to get that child back. So. Child is, these children are defenseless for, for the most part, yeah. you know, in these situations. Uh, and if you don't think this is happening right here, call the district attorney. <laughs> yeah, for call, sure. Call the FBI. Ask them. Oh. Yeah. Right. I know what's happening here. Yeah, it's happening. Right. <laughs> well, we're going to have someone from the San Diego Human Trafficking Task Force speaking at the event. You are? Yeah. yeah. Very cool. So they will be there. Well, let's get to some of the deets. <coughs> so it's May 14th. Yes. Yes. So right around the corner. Yeah. Uh, where are you guys going to have this at? The Horton Grand downtown. Downtown. Yeah. Yeah, that's right there on Fourth and like. It's on Island yeah. Avenue. An island. Yeah. Three Eleven Island Avenue. Okay. But they have valet parking, so don't worry about getting in and out and all that kind of good stuff. Yeah. There's parking all around, and uh, we're gonna have lunch, mm -hmm. vendors, wonderful networking, amazing people, really amazing people. No, all the speakers are volunteering their time. Everybody's volunteering their time, so that we can give the most to the kids so yeah. it's pretty amazing and we have speakers flying in from Colorado we have people flying in from Connecticut mm -hmm. to come wow. so yeah so please come it's gonna be awesome and we have the most amazing sponsors that we've got we're up to over ninety thousand dollars in giveaways yeah Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> so for a ninety seven dollar ticket the first 100 registrants will get a seven hundred and fifty dollar swag bag now that is incredible that's over 750% return on your investment <laughs> in less than 30 days. So if I was doing that with real money, you'd be throwing not $97 at me, but like $97,000 at me. Okay, going, here you go. Feel free to do. Uh, yeah, yeah, you're free to do that too. We have a lot of kids. If you uh, yeah. We could help tons of kids. Okay. For $128, you can actually reach rescue and restore a child. $128. Mm -hmm. $128. Mm -hmm. So that's the magic They'll number. actually, because the proceeds are going to Life Outreach International, so they'll actually go in, get a child, put them in a home, clothe them, feed them, and get them back to the life. That this they is amazing deserve. work that you guys are doing. Really, yeah. really appreciate it. So, mm -hmm. so necessary. 
uh, please contribute if you can. If there's any way if you can make the event, are there other ways to contribute? I'm assuming people can. They make could the go event. online to <coughs> nyny2016.com and it'll link you over to Eventbrite, and you can just make a donation if you'd like to. That mm -hmm. that'd be fabulous. I want to save a child 128 bucks. Yeah, and there's sponsorships there available too. So awesome! Thank you yeah. guys so much for your time. Really appreciate oh. all the good work that you're doing. Thank, Thank you. you so so much. Yeah, yeah we're excited about Stick it. Stick around for more Smarter San Diego TV, where we guarantee to make you smarter than everyone else. Commercial free.